pre-op, it includes the heart transplant. Mm. God is about yeah. to give us a heart transplant in Mount Zion. Oh. God, I'm telling you right now. So what's the new heart going to include? Because it's just like when you go and get your knee replaced or anything else. God's heart transplant includes a new mind, Come on. a new will, the emotions. God says, I'm going to give you a total makeover. <laughs> Anybody here need to be made over again? Yeah. I, I, I just, I, there's some days, I, there's some days, I, you know what? There's some days when my mind is right, but my will is all this. I say to myself, I, Lord, and that's why he said that you have to have the mind of Christ. That's why Jesus says, not my will. Wouldn't it be something if all of you came to church and said, God, not my will, but thy will. And so God is saying, I, 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 listen, next Sunday, I'm going to give you a new mind. <laughs> I'm going to fix up, give you a new will. Mm. And I'm going to take care of those sporadic emotions. Woo! All right. I'm going to give you a total change. God says, I have, you have a stony and a rebellious and cold, unresponsive heart. God says, and the result of that, when your heart is stony, when your heart is cold, when your heart is rebellious, when you're unresponsive, you can't obey God's word. I'm going to say that again. When your heart, when you have a heart of stone, when you have a heart of stone, when you are stubborn, when you are rebellious, when you are deceitful, when you are dishonest, says, you can't respond to my word. Can I help somebody? Light and darkness yes, yes. can't dwell together. God says, as a result, you can't keep my word. 